Melbourne victory season has officially come to an end with a 3-2 loss to Korean side Shongnam Ilwa in the Asian Champions League. The victory, victory rather, put on a gutsy performance though, twice coming from behind before an 83rd minute strike from the home side. Playing for nothing but pride in their final game of the Asian Champions League, Melbourne Victory were always going to have their work cut out for them against the group leaders. Not a bad ball either. It was a brilliant ball. It took the keeper out of the situation. The pressure came thick and fast from the K-League side. Free header. It was that man again, Ognanovsky. And the victory had no one to blame when the lead deservedly went to their opponents. And it's a tap in at the back post. It was coming for Siong Nam. Ernie Merrick called on some of his young stock at the start of the second half, and his decision immediately paid dividends. Degunjic! 1 1. Well, what a start to the second half. Set up by Carlos Hernandez, young gun Mate Dugandic slotted home with his first touch of the football, and the 20 year old midfielder could have produced a second just five minutes later. He's away again, Dugandic. Onside as well, the youngster. Can he put Melbourne in front? Well, he should have done. But the visitors briefly fell back into their first half slumber and Siong Nam took complete advantage. Melbourne were desperate though to end things on a positive note and Tom Pondelyak levelled it once more. Really well worked for Pondelyak! Beautiful goal from Melbourne! But it wasn't meant to be for the A-League's second best side. They conceded a third to bring an end to a very long season. Lara Pitt, Fox Sports News. Yeah, 3-2 loss in Korea brings an end to a disappointing Champions League campaign, one which never really got off the ground for Ernie Merrick's men. Seongnam finishing comfortable winners in Group E.